Once again, hi guys, this is Angel from PRDB Entertainment. Here's our third tutorial for the Unreal Engine, the UDK. Now, like I told you guys, open your map that we have created the last time on the second tutorial. And today in the third tutorial, I'll be teaching you guys how we can add a path node so we can have an uh, enemy on the map and how you can add a weapon uh to the map uh the weapon is going to be really quick it's not that hard this will only take like half a minute and the path note will take a, a little more it will take like one minute or so now after opening the map let's first use the translation mode so we can move the player start to the corner here to the corner there we go now let's add a wall on the middle here because I don't want to see uh, the enemy in front of me I want to search for the enemy first but I want to put the weapon here on this part here so I can get the, uh, the uh, weapon first and then I'll go uh, after the enemy now right click on the cube let's put 16 for the Y let's put like 200 for the X ah oh, my no no my bad my bad my bad let's put 16 for the X uh, 400 for the Y and let's put uh, for the Z let's put 200 there we go build close this uh let's restore the viewport so we can see where we are there we go yeah we have it right on the middle there now let's add the csg oh let's make it bigger yeah my bad let's make it uh a little bit bigger right click on the cube again let's make this instead of 400 let's put 600 here and let's put it Let's pull this aside here. There you go. Now add the CSG. Now go to your perspective view. There we go. Add any textures that you want. I'm just going to add three textures here. The side. I don't see the sign because the light is not point to it okay come on man put the texture there thank you now the light on translation mode there we go now we can see both sides of the wall now to add a weapon right click on any part of the map uh, no, my bad, my bad. Let's do it. Let's do it uh, in an easier way. Go to your content browser. Go to the actor classes. Go to pickups, weapon, and choose UT Weapon Pickup Factory. After choosing that, close the content browser. Right click on the map and choose Add UT Weapon Pickup Factory here. Now double click on the Pickup Factory. And in the UT Weapon Pickup Factory Weapon Pickup class, you will choose any uh, weapon that you have on the list. So let's choose the rocket launcher. And when you start with it, uh, when you start the game, the rocket launcher will be there. Now we need to build. Uh, okay, we need to build the AA path and the lightning, but that's going to be in the end. Now let's add the path node. Right click on the map go to add actor choose add path note now the path note is going to be the enemy press the end key on your keyboard so it goes to the ground on the floor now be sure that you have selected the the path node and go to the top of your window and view choose unreal kismet now here you will be setting up your path note now we're going to uh, we're going to insert three items here three objects configuration whatever you want to call it and the easiest way if you're a beginner um, 
So you, uh, we're going to add three objects so we can set up the path nodes so the enemy can spawn on the game and he can start shooting at us, uh, shooting at us as soon as he sees us. Now right click on the gray uh, box, go to new action, actor, actor factory, right click again, go to new event, level loaded and right click for the third time and choose new object var using path node 0 every time you insert uh, one path node, a second path node, a third path node uh, it may say new object var using path node 0, path node 1 or path node 3 so be sure uh, which path node you're going to be working on for right now we only have one path node and it's going to start with path node 0 uh, you can click on the object, any of the objects that you have inserted, and as soon as it turns yellow, you can press your control key, you can play around with uh, the objects by moving them. Now, let's link the spawn point with the path node 0. As you can see, it has an arrow that goes to the spawn point. And let's link the loaded invisible with the spawn actor. Now, by doing this, when the game starts, that is that is has loaded invisible the actor factory is going to be working uh with the settings now click on the actor factory and in the factory you have a blue uh arrow here click on that arrow and choose on the bottom U uh, ut actor factory ai now by doing this you will be telling that the path node will be an enemy now we need to choose uh <coughs> you need <coughs> my bad you need to open the uh, factory properties here so click on the black arrow if it's, if it's closed and you need to choose for deathmatch ai you need to choose a pawn class choose ut pawn don't choose anything else put uh, a pawn name just put bot bot one or you can put enemy one like we have done before let's give uh, the enemy the default inventory or if you don't want to use the default inventory you want to use a gun for the inventory list just click on the green cross that says add new item and you will get a list of the uh, weapons the guns that you have so I'm gonna leave the uh, the guy with the link gun here and from here on the spawn count you can make uh, every uh, on the spawn count you can make how much time it's going to be spawning enemies on the on the game if you insert five it will spawn five enemies on the game but the difference is it's going to give you an error because you need to finish the setup because it's more than it can handle now one spawn count is enough for now it's Let's keep it basic. Now close the Unreal Kismet. And now let's go to the view on the top of your window and uh, build. Go to build, my bad. Go to the top of your window to build and build the lining. Click on OK. It's building the lining here. And he is finishing. There we go. And he has finished, closed. You make get a couple of errors don't worry about that now go to the build on the top of your window and choose AA path has build the AA path and now let's play the game and there we have our gun now we have chosen the rocket launcher and that is what they gave us there we go and here we have the enemy and he is dead alone by himself I don't know why let me put that again. Let me get the gun. Oh, oh, almost died there. There we go. How are you looking at, man? How are you looking at? I'm jumping too, man. I'm jumping too, man. I'm gonna kill you. <laughs> One more time. We have the rocket launcher. And I'm gonna kill this fucker here. Oh! Nice job, man.
So there we go. That's all for the third tutorial. This is Angel from PRDB Entertainment. Hit the like button, write a comment, don't forget to subscribe. On our fourth tutorial, I'll be teaching you guys how to insert vehicles to the game. Bye, guys.